that, I was saying to myself, all right, protests and all of that is really, you know, I, I, I think it's great to raise awareness, but who's actually getting out there and, and touching people and, and, and speaking to people and seeing how people feel? It might not just be police injustice or things like that that affect people. It might be, you know, uh, student loan debt or, or housing or, you know, um, or just uh, yeah, paying for daycare, like, like those type of calls. So um, I thought to myself, I was like, man, I would, just watching TV, I was thinking to myself, man, I would like to see just, it start with imagery. I would like to see um, less less black people being depicted in a certain way, you know, just based off the imagery. So, like that line of, have you always had that line of thinking? You just wanted to see more positive? Right, so so me personally, um, kind of a little backstory. Uh, originally from Nigeria, um, whole name is Kola Wale, so that's kind of a mouthful. I always make the same joke, man. You know what I'm saying? It's like, you know, say it three times past, I did, you know? So everybody, when, when you got a name that got like uh, a, a bunch of syllables, everybody always condenses it, right? So they always try to simplify it, so, so it ended up being walls. Um, so no, just kind of coming from that background from Nigeria, you know, you have your parents and, and they're traditional and, and they instill these values in you, work hard, yeah. um, do the right thing, you know, follow applicable laws, so on and so forth. So and I was kind of going a little great. deeper and, and then you kind of start acting like um, it was actually a female who, who, who mentioned that. And then you kind of go into, all right, so are you big on fashion, so on and so right. forth. So you get, you just kind of dive into the, uh, the right. questions and, set, and segue until you get to the, the nitty gritty of it. What are the... Uh what are some of the uh, most common responses that you get? Man, as far as like the, the area, one thing, it's a lot of people in the DC, Maryland, Virginia area who are creatives who gravitate towards this. Okay. Because I, I think there's something about the creative mind. What's a creative for those who don't know? Uh, creatives are individuals like artists, painters, um, people in culinary arts, uh, fashion designers, you right. know, people in those creative fields. And um, they kind of gravitate towards it, and, and this is just me uh, theorizing. I'm, I'm thinking to myself, maybe it's because like a creative mind is is more so a liberal mind in a sense, you know. Yes, exactly. So so they kind of gravitate towards it. But um, to answer your question, the the common response I get from artists, creative artists, is just a crab in the barrel hate type of mentality that permeates through all the That's area. not my first time hearing this about it. If we're going to keep it real, um, a lot, I know a lot of rappers who talk about going to Atlanta because uh -huh. they say in Atlanta they show everybody Bruh. puts everybody on. You exactly. Know, you know. Yeah, just like that. that yeah. and, and, and that's what I get, not even just from the rappers though. Um, there's um, a really, really cool young lady by the name of Valencia. She's a fashion designer. Uh, she went to the Art in Institute in Atlanta. And um, just kind of to juxtapose what you said about that, um, she's saying that in Atlanta, it's so oversaturated because that's like the new black mecca, I guess after Harlem, that everyone yeah. flocked to it, Atlanta, and that's where a lot of the, um, a lot of the uh, uh, entrepreneurship is, is bubbling. Right. So she's saying it's so oversaturated out there that you know a lot of people don't even really, really want to give you a shot because they feel like if they do, they'll, they'll end up competing with you. You know, so she ends up coming out here and then she felt like it was the dynamic shifted where people are showing her a lot more love here. Right. You know, so it's it's it's, yeah. it's a strange thing like that. But I guess uh, if you've been somewhere, if you live somewhere for so long, then you'll naturally see, I guess, so, the uh, the negatives maybe. So to your point about that, and I'm going to shift from rappers to the creatives as you uh, as you call them. Mm -hmm. There's actually something a renaissance.